Right now, the so-called Don't Say Gay Bill is in the Florida House of Representatives. The bill has drawn controversy across the state. CBS 4 Ted Scout is following the progress of the bill, which is getting closer to a vote in the House. Ted? Yeah, Elliot, right now the Florida House is debating what's become known by opponents as the Don't Say Gay Bill. Let's take a live look inside the House chamber right now uh, in Tallahassee. The actual name of the bill is the Parental Rights and Education Bill. Now, as it's written, it says that classroom instruction by school personnel or third parties on sexual orientation or gender identity may not occur in kindergarten through grade three or in a manner that's not age appropriate. It also called for teachers initially to let parents know if their child was questioning their sexual orientation or gender. That part was withdrawn this afternoon before the debate. Since 345, Democrats have been lining up to question the bill. The bill's sponsor, Joe Harding, defended the proposal. What topics specifically about people like myself, LGBTQ Floridians, are not appropriate to teach in the classroom? Is it topics about how LGBTQ people love one another? Is it topics about our marriages, which are legal in the United States and in Florida? Where we can go wrong here is going down the slope of discussion versus instruction. So I just want to reaffirm that what we're talking about is nowhere in our bill are we banning any discussion that a student could, could have relating to any different variation of families and how they can look. And that debate is still going on right now in the Florida House. As for the Senate, there is a similar bill that's uh, going through committee there. No vote has been scheduled or no time on the Senate floor has been scheduled just yet. So meanwhile, right now, just waiting for that vote in the House that could come at any time. Live in Hollywood, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.